It's Wednesday the 22nd. Wednesday the 22nd <laughs> of September 2021. We're going to call this video Unlimited Wealth Chops, Unlimited Wealth Game by my GOATS. Mr. Harding, he needs no introduction. But uh, for those that ain't familiar, this is the GOAT right now. The young protege. <laughs> Kish. J.A. in the building. Yeah, man. Inside. Okay, bless. Inside. Wow. Live. Liven up yourself. <laughs> okay, right. okay. Oh, yeah, just deep. You got two Jamaicans in the yard. Yeah. <laughs> Well, yeah. in the this, is, this, yeah. this video alone is history. Is this on, this is two Jamaican British people on, talking about crypto. Yeah, man. Our ancestors could never have imagined. I'm done here. <laughs> huh? I'm done here. Of course you're here, bro. You, you're the, you are the source. You are the one that put this together. Well, the plug. You don't need mentioning. You so, are the mention. You are uh, it. Shout, shout my manager Eski in the back. You know what I mean. Shout, shout. She be starting that finance and eat. <laughs> um, so let's just start with a with a quick introduction because most people um, watching this will be least familiar with yourself. Mm. Just mm. quick introduction. Who are you? What do you do? What kind of someone who didn't know you? What what would you say you do? Um, as well as being like a DeFi and penny stocks. G. Wizard. Oh, um, I don't know, just be myself. <laughs> I do a lot of different things. I have a lot of different, um, like, um, things that I do in it. So, yeah, there's a, there's a, there's a lot. There's I a mean, lot. okay, right, right. This just the positive too, vibes money attracts. This, this guy's been way too humble. So, outside of just being a wizard at decentralized finance and crypto, and um, knowing about penny stocks and being being into that, this guy's selling scooter. Show shout, shout out the scooter brand. Um, Doc Mar. Doc Mar, make sure you follow them. Yeah, he's got. Where's well, the clothing line active? Vintage House Apparel. Okay, there we go. Pretty Boy Productions. Yeah. New Gods um, Music Crew. Yeah. As well as your own music. So you got a few bars. Yeah. You're into fashion. Yeah. You're into crypto. Like how how does how do you even get there? As a like, don't you game as well? No, not really. But oh, right, okay. I'm I'm a I'm in a group. Man's affiliated. Man's got my group outside uh, team player. So. How do you how do you juggle like, Wait, wait you... what what game do you play? Um. Well, for me, I, I it's more PC games. Yeah, it's more like on the consoles. Do you see that? See how the way that the universe works in a mad way. Don't tell me you got someone that plays Counter Strike. Uh, maybe actually, maybe. We've Imagine got... I'm working with a 14 year old kid that does video editing and wants to video edit for professional gamers or gamers. Okay, don't, don't, that's lit. That's that is lit. how. We've got to talk about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah we'll play, man. That's lit. That's mad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, 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 the I, universe just goes, all right, cool, here you go. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All the time, isn't it? All the, all the time. time. Are oh, you time. looking for this? All right, cool. Yeah, Next yeah, person yeah. you talk to, there you go. That's there you it. Go. No, that's how it is. Mad. Man. Honestly, I feel like we're in control of everything, fam. We're in no, control honestly. of that shit. Whatever you want, just be righteous, be the right person. Mm -hmm. Do what you know you need to do. Put the right energies out there and it'll yeah. just go. There you go. Yeah, think positively, think about it going well. Mm, and and be abundant well. to others at all times. Yeah. So, I want to add a lot of value to people in this video. And I feel like the first... That was it, that was the most viable thing you could ever say. Okay, no doubt. <laughs> I, I, I was video hard, done, I was see you later guys. Bye. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I do want to talk about like direct things, right? So, one thing I always say to people is, one of the e one of the most straightforward ways to make an income in this world is help other people mm. make more money or get mm. more customers. Literally, guys, a large um, percentage of my income for the past decade has literally been taking a referral fee slash commission for getting someone else work. And you literally can do that by knowing a lot of people. Mm. Like, in my fault, okay, do you... I want, I want you guys to check here because I know how many I've got. Let's let's see who's got more numbers. Keish, how many numbers you got on your phone? Eski, how many you got? Oh, That's good. my manager in the back. And Miss Hardy, let's see how much you got. I'm on about 6,000. Is it? Okay, cool. I don't have that much. Well, you have to bear in mind, I've been a professional networker for, like, how long? 241. Okay, so my manager got 241. Miss Hardy got 6.2. I, I don't even check, bro. 
An Android Go is just as well. Where's my phone? Yeah. Is it an iPhone? Yeah. Go to the bottom, just like scroll right there. And it was more than that, but I lost mm -hmm. my phone with all my contacts from Manchester. Wow. So I had to start again. So I've I've had the same number since two thousand and six, I think. So about fifteen years. And yeah, I got um I got about one thousand three hundred. Five thousand six hundred and eight. But show show them, show them, show them. Show them, show them. <sighs> So this is why your messages you don't get read your, or responded. Where's, I can't find. I can't figure out how to do it. But you're gonna have to. Someone's gonna have to edit it and put the thing in. Nah, don't, 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 don't. Yo, I got. Look, imagine some of the first numbers in my phone are people in Indonesia and they put their name in Thai or Indonesian. Oh. I don't know who they are. I just met them out on Metal. Crazy. <laughs> so the people are like, oh, Mike, how come you always get these opportunities? How come people always shine shine you? How come you know these people? And I'm like, because what is it? I am a You're gonna have to pat on my phone. Serial networker. Oh, like shit. you put me in a building, okay. I'm gonna come out with ten numbers. Yeah. That's just I tr I learned from oh, all so the books you're, I was reading. You're, you're off cam, you're off from all the books I was reading, it right. just said that to have success, your network is your net worth. Oh, okay. So I just took that bare seriously mm -hmm. and just went, all right, cool. I'm going to collect people like Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to catch them all. Okay. And I'm just going to show value and love to as many people as I can until I die. And then as a byproduct, value will come back to me. Yeah. That's it. Thanks. Like my whole motto in life is, look, treat people so good so that if someone says something bad about you behind your back, people will never believe it. Mm -hmm. That's it. My whole thing is Energy. over my whole life. People are like, what's your purpose? My purpose is to uh, what's my saying persistently pursuing pers persistently pushing people past previously perceived potential so mm. if wait 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 say that again slowly mm -hmm. say that again slowly please sir persistently pushing people past previously perceived potential wow so that is my hot. That's my life purpose. That's a clip by the bars, bars. That's that's why I've been created on this. On in this hey. is me, my vessel. That is my job. Yeah. It's not to make money. It's not to do anything. Yeah. It's just to literally go. This is your perceived potential. My job is to just raise that bar. Raise that bar. Yeah. In either a conversation, literally. You, if you've watched this right now, I've done my job. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's yeah, it. Because that, yeah. there's no way somebody's not going to be inspired by what you just said. Yeah. Like, you can you can be a billionaire angel investor and take something from that. That's it. That, and if, every, if everyone lived life like that, mm. yeah. if all everyone woke up and went, all I'm going to do today is find someone, a random stranger, and leave them at a higher vibration than when I first met them. Mm. Mm, that's a good that's intention. It. Yeah. Just okay. make someone smile, make someone feel like they're having a good day, yeah. make, teach someone something, recommend a book to someone, recommend yeah. a YouTube to someone, connect someone with someone, yeah. and just do that every day. And you have a sick day every day. Yeah. Mm. You never go to bed going, oh, today was a shit day, because you've got the, those little things where you've gone, oh, yeah, but I did this for this person, oh, that person, I made you a know, difference. So basically, Keish, you know M3, right? Yeah. Yeah, so shout out to EMM3. Go check out our song Televised the Revolution out now on Spotify. You get me? But yeah, so M3, he's a producer and rapper from South London. He um he 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 told me that as like artists and creatives, we're energy benders because we have the power mm. to bend energy, right? Mm. So let's be honest. If Drake dropped a song and encouraged people to eat less meat, it would literally reduce yep. the amount of pollution on, on, in the world. Yeah. Like, 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 like that, right? They put influencers for a reason, bro. Right. So, but it's very interesting how like the most influential people in this world, I could be completely wrong in it. Maybe he's building a whole, um, uh, I don't know, school in Africa. I don't, I don't know, or the Caribbean or whatever. Like, I, I don't know. It is uh, privately, but publicly, I don't. Drake. Yeah. Oh, I, I, don't, I don't really want to talk about Drake's sensitive subject at the moment. I don't. Well, I, I, I believe. I, I'm just. I'm. I'm wary. That's all I'm gonna say. Okay. Mm. Well, I, well, I, well, I, well, we can use any famous person, really. I just use him at the top of my mind. I prefer to use Kanye because let's, let's just use Kanye, right? So, um, but then again, Kanye isn't he? He's actually doing a few things. Yeah, he's actually right? building farms and schools and everything. Yeah, exactly. So okay, let's not use Kanye. Use <laughs> little baby. We're just skipping through. I like little baby. Use Paul Pogba. <laughs> Who's that? 
Oh, fuck that. Oh, oh, my God. God. He doesn't know PSG. He doesn't know Paul Pogba. That, I wish I was you. Is that a Paul Pogba? <laughs> I, wish, I, wish. I wish I was you. Why Your life is so stress free with that football. <laughs> I just realized it has stress free life. Bro, think about it, right? It's actually ridiculous how how worried worried emotional you get over over. over. Okay, right. Let me, give, men let me let me give you my take on sports. Right, I respect sports people because they had to work a long time to get to that skill level. Mm-hmm. Right, I understand why people enjoy sports because life is hard and sometimes you just want to believe in something. Mm-hmm. But I, as an individual. Do not look like look like putting my belief and emotions in something I can't control. It doesn't matter how much you cheer or think one team is gonna win. Yeah. Right. Probably not United against West Ham. <laughs> so so like like I mean do your thing, but to me I mean I don't know. I've reached a certain. It is very illogical. So watching football is. So do you know, do you know what's also illogical? Oh. Screaming over an artist on stage. No, yeah. but I've worked like, at, I've worked at stadiums before. But the energy's mad. What I don't understand is why there are unhealthy people that drink alcohol, eat rubbish food, but are so passionate about with football. Big bellies that are unfit that can't do sport, dreaming that they could have done it. Watching people getting excited about what they're doing, but these people that they're watching are people that don't drink alcohol, are athletic people, are the complete opposite. You know what I'm saying? So it's just this is a weird thing. that little yeah, drinking beer to it and like ah, throwing beer. Like, ah, what's going on? It's that moment of time what's where they, I think it's a big escaping vice. Yeah. I think football yeah. is like alcohol. No, literally alcohol. football. Yeah, should have told us that VR is coming. Yeah, yeah, hundred percent. Like, like because 100%. because because like the, the whole world of team sports. Yeah, as soon as it was team sports and internet, like certain people would have just realized. Oh, virtual reality, reality is the future because people can be that excited over something else that's not, it's not real. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. if you think about it, like, sports is not real in the sense that whatever you think and do doesn't matter. It's them that are playing. Well, imagine wrestling. It's actually completely fake. Oh, you, yeah. You've never even touched mm. wrestling, have you? Oh, what, you mean WWE. like, you mean like, oh, no, yeah, yeah, no, no, I don't know about WWE. Oh, okay. yeah, well, I, 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 yeah, no, 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 I've seen, I've seen, is it Ray, Ray Mysterio? <laughs> Great okay, stock, yeah. by the way. What, WWE? Yeah. You can buy their stocks in the stock market. It's one of the best plays <laughs> of the last five years. Are you investing in WWE? No, but I know, I know about WWE. I didn't know you could invest in the stock market. Yeah. Damn. They're, they're, they've got a monopoly on the industry. They have no competition. How come I never hear stocks people t- talk about WWE stock? Because it's a proper, like, inside, if you know, you know one. Oh, well, mm-hmm. now you guys know. Well, have a look know. into it. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Have a look into their competition that doesn't exist apart from AEW, which is just about to go bankrupt. Oh, yeah, they're, they're working anyway, man. Is AEW they, they have no competition. Driver. They have a monopoly on the... And this, one person owns the sport of wrestling. Mad, it? It's like F1 with Bernie Eccleston. If F1 went on the stock market, you'd say? F1, if you're watching this, think about going on the stock market. They might actually be indirectly. Hollerance for the IPO. Yeah, you know what I mean? Hollerance for the IPO. Yeah, the damages and yeah. people. Yeah, Alright, live yeah. teaching. Eske, do you know what IPO is? No. So IPO stands for initial price offering. It's basically where you buy your stock before it goes public, public on the stock Dude, market. Bro. And in crypto, there's an equivalent called ICO, which is initial, initial price coin. or initial public offering. Yeah, sorry, an initial public offering. Um, and then in crypto, there's one called ICO, where you buy a coin before before it goes. But we've mad drifted here, you know, because the question was, we were thinking of someone that makes impact. So let, let's go go with little baby. I have completely forgotten the trailer. Thought I'm not gonna lie. We were talking about people and musicians and how they impact the world. And oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So so it's interesting how a lot of the most influential people in the world publicly yeah. don't seem to be influenced. And it's like, it's, okay, respectfully, you can be the most influential person in the world or one of, like, Lil Baby, yeah? I believe the reason is because being public about charitable things can be... Um, Damaging. Yeah, or perceived badly from yeah, certain like Bradley. types of people. So that what happened no, with Jay-Z? No, 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 he like, no, most of his investments. It's business. It's business. No, 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 no. no. So, 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 okay, cool. I understand it's not like posting my charity. Say, it's like someone being like, I'm getting more power. 
in front in front of everyone. Hey yo, yeah, that's, yeah. that's all it is. Yeah, yeah. So so okay. So so maybe not posting about charity, but I don't see like the most influential people influencing people to do good things. Like this, yeah. a serious lack of righteousness. I want to quote a lot of from Kanye that he was in his Zayn little interview. By the way, if anyone really thinks Kanye is crazy and they don't understand him, just watch I'm all of his Zayn low interviews. Just watch them. Go as far back as you can. Watch one of the, his one that he did on BBC Radio One. Look at the things that were going on in his life. Then watch the next one. See what was going on in his life. And the guy literally astral projects the future. He literally says what's going to happen, and, then and it happens. happens. Yeah. And he tells you all the problems that are going on in his life and why what's happening is happening. Mm -hmm. And then. He does it, yeah. like with the trainers. Like it's well documented. It's super do you know, do, well documented. Do you know what? Kanye West is literally one of the most documented humans on earth because of the of the Kardashians, right? Yeah, and people don't realize how much bullshit and how many times he's been snaked until you watch the interviews. When you watch the interviews, you watch them in full. You're like, I've been snaked. Oh shit! This guy's getting snaked differently all the time. time people yeah. are trying to finesse it but by billions though yeah, yeah, like yeah, nike yeah. finessed him out of billions with the yeezys yeah like billions his record label finessing him out of billions yeah. everyone's always forget finessing him out of billions that's why he went fuck it i'm gonna get on this ownership shit yeah. and when he did that he woke up a lot the of people a lot of people went well. nah you know what I want to own shit and one of the... the this most... is what we're doing right now. Yeah. We're owning intellectual yeah. property. We're stamping blockchain sensei yeah. in the metaverse. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? As people who are historically correct, whether this video gets lots of views or not, in the near future, you damn well know people are going to go back to this and be like, these guys were on their shit. And to quote, to quote Kanye, won. what he says in that interview is he goes, there's certain things in the hip-hop and in the kind of black R&B culture or just the hip hop culture let's just mm. widen it out to all races and all demographics because it is yeah. that's what it is yeah. is there's certain things that you need to have that make you a credible or a part of a culture yeah. so like Hennessy like mm. a Rolex yeah. like a Merc a Lambo yeah. a Ferrari or all these things that make up the culture Nike trainers yeah. Air Force Ones yeah. all these things and Kanye said how come none of those things that make the culture are owned by people in the culture? Mm. The only one that there is, is Ace of Spades. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. It's just our ownership. And it's just people, the culture is being milked by people yeah. that aren't in it. That yeah. don't give a fuck about it. Don't care. Don't care. That's why it needs a fuck with blockchain yeah, sensei, because we care. There, but yeah, yeah. It's it's yeah. starting now. Yeah. It's only just started really. Yeah, yeah. Recently. Yeah. Like it happened a little bit with Fat For Fat Farm and like maybe Fubu and, and whatever. But it didn't it wasn't really like happening that hard. Yeah. But now people are kind of going, uh, you know what? And I think this is where crypto yeah. and blockchain is gonna really Mm -hmm. Open up the space. Okay. I think it's opened up so much already. The game changer is when Shopify and blockchain go like this. Yeah. When Shopify and blockchain go like this yeah. and music, yeah, it's done. Yeah. That's why like, I to musicians are point. going to become billionaires. Yeah. For fun, yeah. just like this. As long yeah, as the art yeah. is dope. Yeah. Because what it's, it's going to be is your merch is going to make you more money than your music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's what's going to The assets. Yeah. It, like, mm -hmm. We're literally giving our fans the opportunity to own to, a part to, to of own, you. To own, like, like, I was just saying, yo, 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 let, let, let me say this out in video now, yeah, because I said this that, to, to my manager, Eski, and uh, these guys never heard this idea, but I'm going to openly let, yeah, people know that they can invest in my music career by paying for a beat or paying for my mix and masking session or funding the video and then I'll, I'll, I'll cut them a royalty check forever on the song. Mad. Why not? So if anybody mad. here wants to pay for a beat that for me... mad. Buy me the beat, send me the beat... That's actually Because that's going to cost me £50. That he makes one of them bangers pay. that's like eternal, like a Christmas... Like, like yeah. one of them Mariah Carey tunes yeah. that's there forever. Uh, and a fan has one to five, ten percent. Yeah. Because they pay fifty pounds for a beat, let's go. Mad. And you know, and yeah. you know, you know why I'm not worried? Because I know my dome is unlimited, so mm. I don't mind if that hit becomes a hit. I'm not gonna be like, oh, I should have bought the beat myself. I shouldn't because at the end of the day, yo, I'm eating with somebody who's supporting me, yo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, do you know what I mean? And then I build yeah, a friendship yeah. with them, 
bangers. And I've got unlimited bangers, like, I, my dome is unlimited, you know what yeah, I mean? Yeah, so yeah, I'm not, yeah, yeah. I live in I'm abundance regardless, them, yeah. so yeah, yeah, so I'm, I'm definitely willing to sign off a little, a little 5, 10, maybe even 20%. Like, if somebody came up to me and they said, like, all right, cool, I'll buy the beat, I'll pay for the recording, mix, and a master, and the artwork, mm. yo, 25%, let's go. Before I forget, Shopify and Twitter only buy 20 Shopify, what as a company? Yeah. Two trillion dollars. Yeah. Oh, that's easy. They're at six hundred and fifty. I think they're at sixty-five billion at the moment. That's how much I think they've been blowing. Wait, 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 wait. Shop Shopify is only worth sixty-five billion. It's not though. It's not worth that much. It's nowhere near a trillion. No, sixty-five billion. I think so. So Check zero it. point. Okay, Google. What is the market cap of of Shopify? That didn't work. <laughs> that didn't work. That would be really cool. Can you Google it? Uh, what? Well, it's not even 0 0.1. Let me check. Let me check. 0 0.1 trillion. Or is this 600 billion? Hey, Siri. I think it's 600 billion. What is the market cap of Shopify? Okay, I found this on the web. No, 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 no. It's not having it. We might have to do it old school typing. Sorry, guys, in the future. We, we're still in, like, yeah, 2020. You, you know, you're like... Oh, we, we still do this you, typing thing. your things with your minds. Yeah, we, we still sure, type. Man. Yeah, we type. If you're going to feature people, are going to, like, order virtual ice creams and, and then... Bro, they have robots eat. delivering food in, in Kent. No, not Kent. In one area, bro, like, just near, like, in Surrey. They got, yeah, they got robots that are started. food, like, on wheels, bro, with, like, one it antenna sticking out of it. It has started... Oh, it hasn't started. It already started like two really years ago. Bro. It's already here. The future bro, is now. Listen, like I'm telling people, we're like, not listening. Uh, They're thinking this stuff is coming out in 2030 and 2050. I'm like, no, it's, it's been a how. We're like 400 years behind. Listen, like we're Alexander us. Lorenzo said, if you don't get with this technology, you will be left behind. Facts. Don't be left behind. Minimum. Facts. Just people, get, just, it's it's going to be worse than that. People are going to get left behind on Earth. That's how deep the situation yeah, actually yeah, yeah, really yeah. is. That's what it is. Because people are going to be living longer. So you're not going to live to like oh, 70. You're going to live to like 200, 300. What? Really? Yeah. More than that, bro. Do you know what's happening with science right now? I'd like Do you know the know. reason why the COVID like vaccine was... In your DNA? Do you know why COVID vaccine was created so fast? Yeah. Because they use supercomputing. They use quantum computing to figure it out. and But they didn't use one... They used multiple at the same time around the world. So what's happening with genetics now, what used to take 10 years, they're yeah. doing in one month. Wow. That's crazy. Wait, is everyone here unvaccinated? I am. Mm. You're vaccinated? No, I'm unvaccinated. Yeah, same. Are you? Yeah, well, I'm taking that shit. Because, because like, what if... What if the people who take the vaccine can't live past a hundred? Bro, they're like... What if that's the listen, thing? If you know what, what if that's the thing, bro? If you know what's... What if that's the what's thing? In all of the things that you put in your nose, all of this stuff, it has, it has a alcohol and that shit that actually... Um, yeah, because I get more ill when I do the tests. Bro, it's cancerous as fuck. Bro, bro, think about this, yeah? That, that's, that, that's why I hate taking tests. But we don't want to say anymore because we don't want to lose our views and we don't want to lose, get in trouble with that, like that, YouTube. That, so that. ignore everything we just said. That is just us joking. <laughs> that was funny, that. <laughs> now we've all, we've all got our vaccines, really. We're joking. Yeah, we're vaccinated, man. Come on, come on. Yeah, shout out to Had you got him. <laughs> That thing over there. <laughs> oh, that. Ooh, what's that? Yeah. Oh, we're back. We're back. What's yeah. that? Man. Them ones. I'm trying to do 200, but I'd like that. This one, uh, one of them ones. We don't want to uh, lose our um, views. We don't want the video getting taken down. Because the video will get taken down. <laughs> it will. We just spat all that game and all that knowledge, and it'll get taken down. Market cap, oh, 182 billion. Tell okay. me that's not facts though. The video will get taken down. I don't even know. People say wild things. No, it will it? not. Everything is blessed. Only <laughs> in everything <laughs> shall happen as it will. Listen, everything is entertainment. It is what it is. is. Oh, we didn't even put a disclaimer. We'll oh. disclaim the disclaimer in the beginning. Yeah, the beginning. 
and we'll say that we're actually, we actually we make jokes that other people may find offensive. Offensive, yeah. We'll, yeah, we'll and then we say everyone stay blessed. Yeah. Stay safe. Do the right thing. Yeah, always do the right thing. <laughs> <laughs> All right, 25 minutes. Let's just wrap this up in five. Okay, practical, 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 practical. So, obviously, we want to see. I'm a thousand contacts deep, by the way. One, oh, 1,000? 1, yeah, 1,000. 1,080? Yeah. Yeah, that's good, though. Young 21. Yeah, that's sick. You start a young one. Bro, I'm 10 years your senior. 22. You're 22? Oh, yeah, shit, I'm man. 10 years your senior, bro. So just keep doing what you're doing for 10 years, your contact list should be at least 10,000 people. Already. <laughs> Easy. If you got 10,000 people, and now, because I'm telling you this, if you yeah. make them concentrated quality. So mm -hmm. get contact, get numbers for everybody. Yeah, get yeah, contact yeah. with everybody. Yeah. You never know who someone's going to turn it into. Right. You never know what's going to happen in someone's exactly. life or in your life. Yeah. So it's like the 3D printing thing. Yeah. Met a guy that did 3D printing four years ago, didn't know where it was going to come useful, but I was yeah. like, oh, okay. I'm interested in what you do. Boom. Yeah. Easy. You just gotta stay blessed with everybody. Never burn bridges. Mm -hmm. Stop talking to people. You can stop talking to them and be like, look, we're just not really vibing at the moment. I'm gonna stop talking to you for a bit. But never be like, I'm never talking to this person ever again. Right. Unless they completely violate you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I give, give everyone a two chance rule. Two you violate me once, but if the second time you violate me, I disappear out of your life and it's your loss because I know the asset that I am, that mm. I can bring to people's lives. Mm. I know the opportunities and the value I can bring. So if you violate me twice, that's a fat L for you. And you hold your children and your grandchildren. <laughs> Tell and me I'm lying. And their grandchildren. <laughs> Tell me I'm lying. <laughs> This is so tell, tell me I'm lying. I'll sort out your auntie, no, your grandma, and your mother. <laughs> tell me I'm lying, bro. This is the Kanye. Kids, 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 kids. Bro, that's me, bro. I'm off grid, bro. I'm doing this for my kids, 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 kids. Great, 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 great. No, but you know what? Yeah, if somebody snaked me twice, I could still talk to them on no. a on a on a on a pay on a, on a pay break. Depends the level of snakery yeah. in it. Yeah, all oh, right. Yeah, the level. Some level people snakery. are on that yeah, chief yeah. snake. Yeah, 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 yeah. Some people are moving more. Fucking mad than the snake in the jungle book. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I feel like... You've heard him once. <laughs> like, pe people can do things wrong two times, but then it's really hard. Like, yeah, like, yeah. like the barrier... And, and, then, and then it depends how, how, how badly they put, they're messing you over. Now, yeah. if, now if someone's going to... I think, like, if someone's going to do you wrong three times, that's why, oh, no, you got gone mm. forever. It's not a mistake. Like, it's not a mistake now. It's not. It's not a mistake. Because, because, because I could forgive somebody a third time. So, sorry. Um, yeah, first time's easy. Second time... Yeah, it, it is. Do you it, get the warning. It, it, it's like it's, no, no, no. Second time is really hard because for me to take you back, like you gotta grind mm. for it back. Do you know what I mean? Mm. Like you gotta show. And most people, most people never put the legwork in, so they don't ever forgive them. Mm. <laughs> mm. Do you know what I mean? I think that's what it is as well. It's just it's about knowing. It's about loving yourself and protecting yeah. yourself, and yeah, yeah, yeah. If I you love like yourself, finding you just... forgiveness is important. Though. Mm. Yeah, you have to forgive people. Yeah. Because yeah, I forgive, but if if someone like say know, for example you someone vials mm. and then you stop talking to them, you delete them out of your life. Mm. Leave it possible that there's people that they can contact yeah. to say, look, you know what? I realized five, ten, twenty years ago I was a dickhead. Da -da -da, yeah. I want to apologize. Yeah, because people change, man. I've seen mm. it. Remember, forgiveness is when it doesn't affect your past, present, or future. Mm. Bars, 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 bars. 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 Buzz, buzz, buzz. Yeah. But yeah, man, that's that's. Let's let's ask you a question. Let's do a question. I, I like saying, what? Nah, not the younger one. That's that's jarring. That question. The question would be, number one piece of advice you could have told yourself last year. No, last year. Mm. So me, I just I, I just off. So I'm. September 2020, what was I doing? Nine pound an hour, kitchen porter job. I started that in July when I was mad broke. So July, August, September, I had about two months to start. I've probably just about caught up on my rent with my landlord. I think I reached my first thousand pounds in savings, had a bit of Bitcoin, had a bit of ETH. I would have told that person, yo, you need to go harder. Mm. Like you was about to go hard anyway, mm -hmm. but you really got to, 
change your life but right now like there was still a few lazy moments there, there was still a few mm. bad habits that could have been kicked mm. out and i should have said to myself yo this time next year if you get certain plays right oh. and you just work even harder like you might be seeing 50k by the end of 2021 mm -hmm. now i'm probably i don't want to say i don't want to block my blessings but i don't think i'm going to see 50k this year it could happen you know what i mean but if I would have just doubled down on certain things, I would have definitely ended this year with, with, you see with 50 you get an accident, you know? Yeah, I could see that an accident, yeah. In well, London, and the things we're doing. Yeah, of course. That's one like NFT. But, 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 what I'm, but what I'm saying is, I would have assured it. Mm. I would have assured it. If I was just like, if I said to myself, yo, go buy that real estate in November. Don't wait till January, February. Mm. Don't, don't sit on these things, you know what I mean? Mm. Like certain investments that I waited on, they doubled and tripled before I got in. Executed this like yeah. dude, this fucking Terra Luna thing is pissing me off, bro. Bro, it's pissing me off. Do you know this last year the amount of things that I've researched <laughs> and I've gone, yeah, I'm yeah. gonna invest in that. Yeah. And I've told Should people on the it? Monday calls, yeah. yeah, I'm gonna invest in this. Yeah. And I've forgotten. And yeah. then I've gone up 500, 800, like Terra Luna. I was just checked. Yeah. I was researching that in like Back in the day, time back, back, back yeah, like yeah. probably Bro, that, January I've 2021. So much on that thing, and then man. fucking did the game episode where I did more research on it in mm -hmm. July, and it was 30 cents. It's now 34 dollars, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. and I'm just like, bro, yeah. Yeah. how's man just missed that? But yeah. I'm abundant, and I know that there'll be other players. But no still, so my one for this time last year would be: do not sell all of any asset. Because this time last year, we were stoked for peas and we sold our Tesla, our Bitcoin, we sold everything. Always leave mm. some. That was, that was just... Can I, can I just show my... That's my ultimate, like, mm. yo, yo, where can... could I be? Yeah. And I'll never know. Can, yeah. I, can, I, can, I, can, I, can I just quickly share my cash out strategy? So my cash out strategy is never cash out more than 50% in one transaction. So mm. say, say, say you've invested £100 in something and the asset goes to 1000 Cool, you've got 10x, right? Now, you, now your assets was worth 1,000. Cash out 500, cool. Cash out 500, now you got 500. Cool, if you wanna cash out more, maximum cash out 50%, what's half of 500? 250, all right, cool, 250. Now you're, gonna, now you're looking at your 250 thing, should I leave the asset, should I not? Mm -hmm. Now if you do cash out from 250, that's 125. I bet you after 125, you're getting cashing out again. I could have been, I could have been just scalping off the top of it. Yeah. But I just took the whole thing out, out of everything and just had yeah. it as cash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just think back and I'm like, yeah, that was yeah. so dumb. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. so dumb. Yeah, yeah. No matter how, no matter how broke you are, leave yeah. me some dust. Yeah. 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 So yeah, that's 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 my one. This time last year. Yeah, shit like that happens, man. Yeah. Is that everyone's this time last year? Yeah, basically. Eski, what was the one thing go you wish you could tell yourself this time last year? Very similar to yours. To be fair, just work harder. Be more focused. There's always time. more in the tank. Yeah. Like the press ups in the morning, there's always uh, more in the tank. I think um, invest more in. I mean, actually, I invested quite. A, I I think I was gonna say invest more in stocks, but uh, I wouldn't say that. I'd say invest more in time with yourself. Oh, all the all them times, fam. I hate you. Because people, that's the one thing people don't I, do. And I, especially I just, last year. I was like basically living at work, just working that shifts. Just working, working, working. Even right. through COVID, all of that. Just yeah, working. Yeah, I was at warehouse, right? Lifting yeah. bare shit. I, I, it doesn't even matter what weight it is, bro. I managed to just pick it up and move it, fam. Yeah, but with that, yeah. that's one of the reasons why the portfolio is so uh, yeah, healthy. Yeah, yeah, you, know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> you did what you had to <laughs> you do at the time, time that you needed to do it at. grinded it out for... Yeah, a whole a bit over the year, I think, or like a year. Just Boom. Out. So we some of those, some of those yeah, Amazon yeah. ships bought bought that bought those ETH, bro. Yo, bro. Those those those, it those, heavy, those digital diamonds. Yeah, it was heavy, man. It was heavy. It's worth it. That's it's worth it. Yeah, bro. It's heavy, but like, ain't nothing wrong with grafting a job if exactly. you know what you're doing it that's for. It. That's it. That's that's the only thing you have to work by percentages. That was my mm. thing. I work by percentages every time I got a paycheck. I split out. And I used certain amounts of business and investing and whatnot. And I had another business that I was running um, that was doing that for a printing business. So like... Guys, can I, can I, can I just make a mad, mad statement? Every single full-time full employee 
with at least £200 disposable income after bills in the UK, if they learn financial literacy, you could literally become... A millionaire. A millionaire in a decade or so. Yeah. yeah. Easily. Seven years if you're good. Easily. Five years if you learn to trade. Yeah. yeah. Ten years. Like, without... With just dollar cost averaging, yeah. £200 a month into the right cryptos and stocks, you can be a millionaire in five to ten years. Yeah. Easily. It's been said. If you oh. do that, if dollar cost average, 200 to £300 into just stocks, yeah. maybe it might take you 20 to 30. If you do it just the S&P 500, then it'll take you about 40. If you do it just the FTSE, it might not happen. <laughs> we'll end it there. Okay, don't invest in the FTSE 100. It's not financial advice.